Okay, and this is are the ingredients we're gonna use to make the crepes. I have a blender, and I have one cup of all-purpose flour, and then I have um, two and a half of regular milk, two large egg, pinch of salt, and I suppose we put some butter, and I forgot, and those crepes come out good. So we're gonna add all the ingredients inside the blender. I'm gonna start by adding the two cup and a half of milk, and I'm using just regular whole milk. Two eggs. I'm gonna add one tablespoon of regular sugar. And like I say, you can add the um, butter if you like, and one cup of the all-purpose flour. If you're gonna add butter, just use two tablespoons of melted butter. I didn't add them, and it came out good. And then we're gonna blend this real, real good. Okay, what I did is the um, the all-purpose flour was on the um, side of the blender with a spatula spoon. You just scrape it and then just do it again. Make sure you are uh, incorporate all the ingredients. If you don't have a blender, you can use a hand mixer. And then I'm just going to pour something in this cup in here. As you see, this is the uh, consistency. Okay, the mix has to has to be. Okay, I'm gonna use this spray. This spray is come with flour, but you can use any spray or even butter. And I have a skillet. I use a new skillet. This is a little bit top um, high, and if you have a like a flat skillet. So use it better because it's more easier when you're going to turn it. And I use a one-third cup of measuring cup. So I just put some of the um, mix in there. And then I'm going to spray some spray. And I'm going to put my heat at medium high, which is number six. I'm going to spray some. I'm going to let it heat it up a little bit. And then I'm going to add the, the meat. You're going to add that. And quickly, you're going to move your skillet because you want it real thing it, it's like a pancake but like a real thing as you see it in here and this don't take too long so probably like a minute or, or so and then when you see them dry you're going to turn them to the other side and cook it for approximately 30 to 50 uh, 30 to 40 seconds now we're going to turn the um crepe Carefully. Don't do what I did in here. Put your finger inside. You just move it like that. And then just let it cook for 30 seconds. Or on the brown, you know. So I'm going to finish cooking the rest. And then I'm going to show you what I'm going to put in my crepes. Or my crepes. I have some in there already made. Okay, I have in here some of a strawberry cut it off and bananas. And I'm going to put Nutella. But I recommend you to put some of the Nutella in a container and put it in the microwave for 30 seconds. I'm using mine like that. But you take the chance that it can break the uh, your, crepe, your crepes. So it's better if you put it in the microwave. I end up putting it in the microwave. So that's what I'm, I'm telling you that. And the amount depends on how you like it. And if you don't like chocolate, if you don't like Nutella, you don't have to add that in there. And then I'm going to put some strawberries. And once again, the amount depends on how you like it. Now I'm going to roll this a little bit different. I'm going to roll this like a burrito. But it's different ways to, to roll the, um, the crepes. So you can do it in triangle. And 
And then, um, as you see, here is one. So I make uh, two, one for me and one for my husband. And I'm going to put some powdered sugar. I put some Nutella on top. And I'm going to put some um, fresh fruit around the uh, um, edges. So now I'm going to let you see my daughter is going to make one. And she's going to use only bananas. And she's going to fold it a little bit different like mine, than mine. And I forgot to mention, I'm going to put some cold whip. And this is a very, very easy recipe. Now I have my daughter, Swaileen. She's going to make hers. So she's going to... <laughs> She's gonna grab one. And as you see, um, I have the Nutella in this different plate because we heat it up 30 seconds. You see the difference? It's a little bit smoother. So you're gonna add the Nutella. She's gonna put some Cool Whip also. And she only gonna put some bananas. Now if you see, she's gonna do like a triangle. So you choose the way you wanna fold it. So this is ready. She's just going to sprinkle some of the Nutella on top. You can use your imagination when you do those things like this. And remember, you, you are the one who's going to eat them, so you're going to put whatever you like. So this is a very, very um, easy recipe. And remember, if you like this video, please thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos. Um, share with your family and friends. Share my videos on your social media. I don't appreciate it. Now she's gonna sprinkle some of the uh, powdered sugar on top. And she's gonna put some of the whole whip. So, and enjoy. So thank you for watching. And I see you on my next video. Bye-bye.